Hey folks, Gast here giving you the Sias Infernal Not Guide. This is, I think, a Grand Hero Battle or not? I mean, I assume it is. It says Reward Map, which is kind of weird. I don't know why it says that. It's almost like they forgot to change this or something. I don't know. It just came out. Who knows what it means. But uh, I'm actually really, really proud of this video. I'm proud of what I did. Um, and I'll show you what I, the units I use. So first... I have a uh, vanilla Black Knight. The only difference is that he has, he's S supported with me. So he's getting HP plus five. That's actually important. I think that's really the only X factor. That's really the thing you would have to work on. Um, I, S, so I S supported my Black Knight because I think he's one of my favorite units to use. Um, and this is definitely, this is definitely helping him out. Uh, the plus is gonna make him pretty much survive anything. This is my Black Knight. There's no SI involved. Uh, he has Distant Defense 3. Um, next is my Jerome, who is also vanilla. He actually has Fortress Defense 2 because I didn't have enough skill uh, skill points to <laughs> get that to 3, so that's what I did. Uh, Rally Attack Defense 2 is super clutch. Rally Attack and Defense, I mean, is super clutch. And Quick Repose 2 is going to be needed. Uh, I have Arden, who is vanilla. Um, he does, he, the re, he has reposition, but I don't use reposition. He has panic ploy too, uh, which is very important for him. And, uh, yeah, what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to, after, I'm just going to disequip that just to, just for the sake of it. And I have Michaelis, who is a, a four star. He has a silver axe, blazing thunder, which comes in the clutch, uh, Iot's shield and, um, threat and defense too. Uh, and Guidance too, which is very important because I have two armors on this team. So I'm just going to go right quick, get rid of this. And I think you guys, I think you Arden fans out there are going to be quite excited to see this because I was really pumped for this. So I actually find this map like one of the like easiest Grand Hero battles ever. Um, yeah, I find, I find, laughable, exactly. I find this map laughable. Um... Yeah, put your put away your weapons, you'll only get hurt, whatever, man. Anyway, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to bring you here. And I'm going to start. So first things first, I'm just using Arden to, uh, since he has Panic Ploy 2, he's actually going to ploy these two. And since apparently this Blade Tome guy is a big deal, which I don't know why, um, I'm going to bring him down here. And I'm just going to do that. Uh, and I'm going to bring, um, I'm just going to end my turn. Because I don't know if debuffs actually, like, happen on this turn or not. Show us how much I know about the game. Anyway, so the first thing I do is I'm going to bring G Jerome down here. He's going to rally Black Knight. Black Knight's going to go up here and he's going to bait. And then we're just going to end the turn here. So this sword bro is going to come in. He can't do anything because he's getting ployed. Uh, and Black Knight actually just almost kills him. He furies himself. And then uh, Black Knight just decimates this kid <laughs> so kaboom whammo um so he's gonna he's gonna swipe himself over i'm gonna bring black knight down i'm gonna rally attack defense again and since we're almost in trouble here i'm gonna bring yes. michaelis over there and i'm gonna bring arden down there so this guy is gonna proc draconic aura which is not a big deal. Do your thing, bro. Black Knight's gonna kick his ass. Boom again. And so we're all going down. Um, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use Guidance here, and then I'm gonna rally attack defense Arden, and Arden is just gonna freaking dunk all over this guy. One hit KO on Sias. Boom, and I'm just gonna leave him here. So because of distant defense and the summoner support, um, well this guy's gonna yeah this guy's gonna use guidance and he's gonna actually proc buckler which is pretty sweet. <laughs> Got the tank going. Buckler's kind of unnecessary, but yeah, yeah. So Black Knight's gonna double him, and then Black Knight's gonna finish off this guy. Boom. And then we're going to uh, move Arden back. And I'm going to rally attack defense Black Knight again. And then we're going to take 
and Michaelis and bring him back. So now this sword guy is gonna go get tank, or he's gonna deal like min minimal damage. And Black Knight's gonna proc <laughs> Black Luna and kill this guy. <laughs> and now the only guy who's left is this dude. So first things first, I'm actually gonna have Michaelis fight him first. And while that's happening, since the AI is just like obviously blocked there, we're gonna have Jerome uh, rally his boy. And we're just gonna move him back because he's pretty much done. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just draining this guy's charge. So now he's gonna proc his thing. Um, and I guess my strategy behind this is I'm gonna bring him back now. He has threatened defense, which I'm pretty sure comes with this kit. I'm almost certain it does. In fact, I'm just gonna look that up right quick because that would be kind of jokes if I <laughs> put that on for no reason. So this guy's gonna come forward. Now, since we have fortress defense and weapon triangle advantage, bonfire's gonna be pretty not that significant. We're gonna get this twice. Um, and then I'm going to, again, for just the jokes, uh, I'm going to have him back out and then have yes. you back in. And since quick repost is, or still guidance is, is happening, I, I don't need to do this. I can just have him tank another hit, but I want to have, I want to show some love to Michaelis. So he's going to get that going. And now the blazing, Don't push me. blazing thunder, <laughs> and that's the kill. Well, so this really just depends on the Black Knight surviving those hits and just being really strong and defensive. Uh, I'm sure Summoner support does things that would help him do that. Uh, I'm sure the HP buff and the defense and the res helping is doing well but that's what I did I found it really easy it took me like two tries um, I just really wanted to use Jerome and it looked like this was a map that Arden could really benefit on because he can like brave sword up and then pursuit ring and Sias has 22 uh, defense it's awful Sias sucked in this map didn't do anything so folks that was my uh, strategy for this infernal map it wasn't that difficult for me um, and I'm really happy I got to use Jerome and Arden and if you guys enjoyed this one, uh, you guys know what to do, and I'll catch you in the next one. Deuces.